Hi everyone. Today I'm going to take a look at layering in Cricut Design Space. And what I have is three images that I want to stack on each other to layer in different colors when I'm finished. So to start out, I bring up a square. And this, when it's finished, it's going to be nine by a little over six and a half. So I'll use a one inch square and I'll duplicate that. You want to keep your squares, and these are alignment squares, and you want to keep them above the highest point of your image. So I'm going to align this one with the left edge. And after I line that one with the left edge, I'm going to group those two together. Now I bring in the second square and I want to align it with the right edge. And then I want to make sure they're aligned across the top. All right, now that I have these, I'm going to ungroup the squares for now. All right, now I can start laying, layering my other images and for this one I'm just going to put it the height that I want and I'm going to go ahead and center it with the image and then for the third one I'm going to place it where I want it because if I center it it winds up too far to the right I'm just going to place this one where I want it and now that I have the image like I want it when it's finished, I'm going to select it all and duplicate it. And you're going to need three copies. And now that I have three exact copies, I can get rid of the different layers on each one. So I'm going to move this one to the back so I can select, I'll get rid of the EMS and the heartbeat, and then get rid of the 50 for this one. And then I'm going to group these and attach them. You can weld them, but once you weld it, it's harder to edit. So next, I want to get rid of the, the white lettering, and I'll get rid of the 50 on this one. And again, select it, group it, and then attach it. And then for the third, I'll get rid of the lettering, and I'll get rid of the EMS, and I'll have the 50. And again, group and attach. And now I'll select my colors. So I want the EMS, and the, these dots here, the circles, I have custom colors that I've brought in and um, you can change the color by putting in the hex number and if you go to a site that sells vinyl, they, a lot of times they have the RGB color code and you can go to a color converter and convert it to the hex color and that way you can put it in design space and have the exact color of the vinyl that you have and so I want this one to be blue. For the 50, I want it to be gold. And now that I have them, they will all line up when I'm done. And you'll be able to, if I was to align these, it'll be just like it was. And this is how I want the finished image to look. And that's how you do a layered image in Cricut Design Space. And I'm also going to do a video on how I get this size image to layer and keep everything straight and lined up. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, please like and share the video. And thanks for watching.